Hi guys, welcome back or welcome to Stuffy Creates. Um, so today, uh, well, first I'm going to start off by saying, did not feel well this weekend. I did not record any videos for the week. Um, but I was wanting to work on stuff today. Um, I'm still not feeling the greatest, but it's okay. Um, I'm, I can function today. Um, but anyway, I saw on, um, Scrapbook and Memories, um, YouTube, um, she's doing this open collaboration, uh, ephemera, hashtag ephemera madness 24, and I thought it was a really cool idea, and I thought it was really cute, and I was like, okay, I want to do my take on this, um, so for February, she's doing bingo cards, so hopefully I did this correctly, um, I did find some paper in my stash, because my whole thing this year is using out my stash, so I didn't want to go online and print anything. I just wanted to use what I have. So I knew I had some paper with some bingo cards on it, so I just went through my stash and found something. Um, I was only going to make one, but I ended up finding another sheet with bingo paper, um, a bingo card on it. So I did up making two, and I absolutely really love them. Um... I will show you in a little bit here. Um, she said you can make them for like your junk journals or whatever you make your ephemera for. Um, I like to make art journals. Um, but a lot of my art journals have lots and lots of fun stuff in them and goodies. So, and I want to start making my um, journals with more like pockets and stuff. So, this was a really fun, fun way to make ephemera for that. So, without further ado, here is what I made. Um, which one should I show you first? Okay, I'll show you this one first. So, this is one I made. Um, this was actually from Timo. It was supposed to be um, for jewelry. But look how thin that is. And it bends. So, I was like, I'm going to use that for paper crafting. So, I took it out. And... I found it and it fit perfectly with um, this little project here. Um, I used four different papers on this one um, versus just a plain like oatmeal -y color um, cardstock. And then I used. Oh, never mind. I was like, what is that? And then I used my bingo paper, which you'll see. Um, on the other one, I used a piece of that for the background here. Um, it's got, like, letters, sorry, it's got, like, letters and, um, music notes and stuff. And then I got, I looked at that same thing and I found this green paper, this green vintage paper. And then I ended up finding this bingo paper. So it's got a bingo card right here with... The numbers so hopefully I did this correctly <laughs> um so I am using a bingo card it's it's on a piece of paper but it works right um and then I found this quote and I thought it was perfect um the color fits perfect the quote I love it so and then when I was gluing it because I wanted the frame this back frame and this to pop up when I was gluing it I broke one of the edges so I ended up breaking the, the other edge on this side to kind of make it match you probably guys didn't even notice but you know that's what I did and I thought it'd be really cool you could like hang it or put like a string through it um I didn't do that yet because I haven't I'm not using it so I don't know what color string or ribbon I want to use so this is my one of them this is the other one I did the same thing with um, the little pendant thing. Um, like I said, super thin. Would not work for jewelry. Um, and then on this one, that was the bingo paper. So that paper was actually with this music note paper. They were the same sheet of paper. Um, so I cut out the, the bingo. Um, and then I... Found this Admit One sticker, I thought, washi sticker. I thought it would be perfect. And um, there's a flower here, but I covered it up apparently. <laughs> there's a flower down there. Um, and then I 
I wanted to add more dimension to this one. So I popped up the quote and the flower. Um, and then I added this bow to cover up the, the ugly. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> and then I did use um, vintage photo um, after the fact. Because um, I felt like it needed a little bit more grunge to it. So that is this one. So these are my two um, embellishments I made for the hashtag ephemera madness 24 using bingo cards all right well i hope you guys enjoyed this video and um please uh look for um scrapbook and memories and look for her hashtag and see all the other um creations that other people have made they're all really cool and <laughs> that's in a roll um, thank you all for watching and I look forward to seeing you all on my next one. Thanks guys. Bye. Have a good one.